Hey everyone, welcome back to Second Nuiga Nook. I'm, I'm gonna keep going. I can see them when I look out the window. <clears throat> Sorry. Gotta, okay, let me just... The light's shining under the night sky. Guy looked out the window, up at the countless street lights and down at the city skyscraper. He looked at the city administration ward, as well as the information and engine energy ward. He hadn't been there since the incident with Ruaha. He suddenly remembered her. Was Ruaha still in her room, staying quiet? He'd already confirmed that her VIP room was equipped with an engine energy lifeline connector. She ought to be staying put in standby mode. Was she alright? Or was this evidence his biggest problem right now? The answer it led him to was himself, the traitor. He was searching for was Guy. But why? Kirkin had violated city law just as much as he had. But was Guy the traitor? If so, should he bring the game to an end? He didn't know. And what was with Baron's death? Was he killed just to point the others towards Guy? Then who's responsible for his death? The murderer? Or the one pointed to by the evidence. Was Guy himself partially responsible? He's dead. Did you kill him, doctor? Did you kill one of the aristocrats? Did you calculate this move to win the game? Can you really be sure about that? All the aristocrats have the same faces, after all. Doctor, Is that the engine spirit that Kia owns? Or the one that Iru gave her? In engine spirit? What's it doing here? He doubted his own eyes. He hadn't even noticed it. Perhaps he should have activated the phenomenon equation in his right eye. A small steel doll, like a medicine can. It peeked out from the shadows of the stable leg, waving its extremities. Then the engine spirit popped out. These weren't rare in the lower tiers. But this was the upper tier, an extremely different place. It may have been different during the chaos of the revival ten years ago, but nowadays engine spirits weren't supposed to be here. えっと。はい。上層兵がいなかったので。うーん。無茶をする。君の形式番号は02045です。ドクター。キーアネさんの友達です。僕。キーアの I see. That girl. She's as mysterious as ever. 上層階段を登るのは怖かったんですけど、でもキーアさんが心配してたので。No, no, that's not right. Think about it, Dr. Gi. What are engine spirits to begin with? Hmm. 
考えることもないです。The, the guards are all gone? Did Kirkin kill them all when he came up or what? No, because he had a letter too, right? Huh. Fishy. His expression no longer held even a hint of amazement or confusion. He understood what he had to do. He understood who he had to denounce. Everything he'd come, uh, he'd been shown since he'd come to the upper tier. It all been clear from the start. It all been a dull circus performance. So, he at your back answers with silence. That's interesting. Then perhaps he should draw the curtain a little early, Doctor Guy. <laughs> so, Kirkin, Ruaha, and Guy. What do you three have to say? Let's begin, shall we? Ore no kikai no chikara. So it's in your nangar. Do yara ore no haibo no yatsuna skedarash. Nava, yasuraka na rushino toikida. Chikara no motorasmo no sonoma marawashi. Simple de kirai janai. The breath of easy death. Gaiken wa kokushoku no kake no ongama da. Gaiken nanza. Ma, do de mo iiga na. So it's de. Skoshi da ke de i. Koroshita yatsu ni kizu o tsukereba i. Reiten go inchi ni mitanai kizu de i. Hifu o karuku kiru teido de. Sore de sugu ni oare. Kurushimi wa nai. Itami mo nai. その貴族どもにはもったいないがな。まあ、これも俺の寛大な慈悲ってやつだ。So, is his breath a type of poison, maybe? And that's why he has those weird smokes that are purple and colored with a rainbow and shit like that. And is that why Ruaha mentioned in that scene that we're not going to speak of that that he uh had some. Sort of like thing with his breath being odd, or I don't know. <clears throat> Continuing on. の事象が彼に繋がるということを現在の僕は理解していた。クルツの言葉が全ての
the Grand Prince is the traitor. I'm gonna call it right now. That's what's gonna happen. Alright, Mask. Let's do this. About the number 41. That number, 41, holds a special meaning in this city. The 41 creatures that bring about calamities. The 41 Kikai who each stand at someone's back. That's definitely no coincidence. There's a reason behind it. The Grand Prince ought to know, as should he, at the peak of the Golden Spiral Staircase. But they won't lend their ears to the 41 voices, because they've forgotten how to. At present, only one person is listening to their voices. Only one. Just one in this vast city. And it's fucking Kirkin, isn't it? Mmm! Because Gee, he doesn't listen to any voices. He just fucking does what he wants, right? What he feels is right. But Kirkin, oh my god. Oh my god. Kirkin and Gee, best friends confirmed, man. Yeah. <laughs> About the industrial accident ten years ago. No records of it remain. Everyone lost their memories of the event. For it to be spoken of despite that, Dreams? They might as well be dreams. Ten years ago, on that day at that time, when the Grand Prince heard of the accident, he wept and screamed. He wailed over the loss of his modest love. And then he cursed everything. But the next moment, he screamed that he loved everything. I will take it back. I offer up my body for that cause. Connect a circuit to Sekyo. We'll use the secret books they provide us with. I'll complete my theory here and now. I shall bend physics and make my make providence my own. Here. Now that my love has been stolen. I will. Until it has been revived. At least. At the very least, even if it's only those who couldn't be born. Those were the words of Grand Prince following the accident. After that, he began experiment that went on for two years. And that was also when the revival, the time when Ignok warped, came to pass. Hmm. Hmm. I have a theory, but I don't uh, want to say it yet. We're going to go through some more of this, and then if my theory starts to pan out a little more, I'll say it. Yeah, because I have so many theories already, I just, uh, I'm not sure. About the Kikai abilities and the 41 causes of death. This information has been scattered and lost. It's probably impossible to compare and contrast them accurately. The only easily understood information consists of memos left over by the Grand Prince. Death by incineration. The right hand of tearing flame. Death by blood loss. The breath of easy death. Death by pressure. The right hand of the shattering king. Death by asphyxiation. The pain tormenting this heart. Death by impact. The abominable dark sky. The left hand of good. The right hand of evil. That is all. Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Alright, so one of those was what uh, Kirkin said his, like, attack thing was named, right? That, uh... Death, breath of death, or something like that, right? And the other ones, that's that's um things that Gi is used to like take down the creatures, right? Like his key guy has like multiple of those, right? Like a flaming hand and fucking pressurization and oh my god, oh my god, guys, what is going on? I have no idea.